Hey guys, welcome to Offshoot Comics Off Topic with your host Kirby Kidd and Black Superman, also known as David Clark and Walter Bryant. And today we are talking about PS4. We just got back from the midnight launch. We played a couple of games, and we're going to tell you about you know how we felt. We're not going to bore you with UI and you know how it was set in the console up because that's already been leaked. So we're just going to tell you about the games we got and how cool they were. Yeah, we're also not going to bore you with uh, all the people trying to upsell us at the, you know, launch. Uh, be yeah. Best Buy, um, look, we know all HDMI cords are the same. I'm not going to buy your $50 monster cables. <laughs> they uh, they tried hard, though. Like, I, I give them that. They tried hard. Yeah, they tried, like, people who were, you know, going to get bonuses for upselling stuff. Yeah, and they're, so, because they're probably, just like, eh. Yeah, they're probably getting up bonuses for upselling Probably. Yeah, they, 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 they never really try and sell you that hard or anything. Mm -hmm. The Epic Bundle was what, like four hundred dollars over the cost yeah. of the four hundred dollars console. Eight hundred dollars, yeah, yeah. So you could have bought two consoles instead of the Epic Bundle. Yeah, I'm just saying. Yeah. So I mean. Yeah, and since like, you can't get it again until until January <laughs> next year, yeah, yeah, you, know, you could have. Now we 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 bought a lot of games. We we got uh, Lego Marvel Superheroes. We got Killzone, Shadowfall, Call of Duty Ghosts, uh, Assassin's Creed, Black Flag, and Knack. I believe that is all. If the other one comes to me. Oh, and Injustice, Gods Among Us. Just the fact Ultimate. that you forgot. Oh, no, there's a reason why I forgot. Let me this inform you. Okay, so, <laughs> so uh, a lot of people were asking... Wait, 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 wait. Uh, uh, before you get to your hate... Oh, no, no, uh, the hate's coming now. No, no, no the hate's coming now. The hate. the hate is coming now. This can't wait. <laughs> this can't wait. Sony said that fight sticks would not work, but they left it open to each developer to, uh, to, to activate them. Okay, so the first thing we do is we pop in Injustice. Yeah, let's play a game we already know. The best thing ever. I plug in my $200 Injustice Gods Among Us fight stick and the lights aren't on. Okay, maybe there's just no light on this thing. Nothing. Nothing. My fight stick is useless. Now, mind you, here's the major problem with that. Okay, now if the fight stick had come out two years ago, and they were re-releasing this game, and it didn't work, then you could go, okay, well, the game's two years old, Fight Stick's two years I old. bought it whatever. in April. Yeah. Okay, I'm so Sony. Pissed. I'm so <laughs> pissed right now. You might want to think about changing that up a little bit, because people who just bought your products mm -hmm. don't want to now suddenly not be able to use mm -hmm. those products. Yeah, and you didn't even offer a PS4 stick. I mean, I wouldn't have bought it, but the, you could have at least offered it <laughs> but you didn't and i'm supreme i mean it's bad enough the dlc i bought for the game is now also useless but then my fight stick i mean mad cats has already said that they're they, they're not going to do it but then again it's not really up to them it's up to the game developer but um come on come on another round apparently somebody says it's on you so get to it that should be day one we downloaded the patch so it was not in there and unless it's just not working randomly because it's, you know, some glitches, I'm upset. Now, once I see the lights come back on, I will no longer be upset. But until that day, so much rage. Now, the good part, since since the hate already came out. Uh -huh. Okay, Injustice plays a lot smoother. A lot smoother. Now, the problem with that is when you've gotten used to playing clunky, clunky yeah. it, it feels funky as everything is just kind of working and like it responds exactly when you're when it's supposed to and it doesn't feel right because it's responding exactly as you do it right and we're not even going to show you the gameplay for a couple reasons um, one I was not playing on a fight stick so it was really embarrassing and two it was so smooth like we were just like attacking past each other <laughs> I mean it was like we were learning from scratch all over again yeah and also we couldn't upload because uh, the patch for uh, gaming Capture devices don't work, or isn't out yet, and then we didn't want to upload to Facebook because we had to sign into PSN. We were afraid to go on to PSN and crash. It, yeah, yeah, it's not working right now. Oh, it's 3 a.m. currently. Just letting you know. Um, but yeah, so yeah, we we didn't want to do that. So, but there will, we will be uh, regularly putting up footage on Facebook once PSN works again. <laughs> now, one other thing, they gave Superman a new animation. Now, it's not. A humongous change no. you know it, it was a little more fluid in the animation or whatever the biggest thing is actually at least for me is that they changed the perspective from which he slams the guy to the ground All right that's about it the rest of it is exactly the same yeah 
But the game looks really good. All the DLC is included. There's a little bar that says Ultimate Edition when you see Injustice, so you know you buy another game. And it loads quickly as heck. Yeah, yeah. That's another thing. PS4, fast as crap. Um, one thing I noticed is that when we were putting games in, it just went straight to the thing. Installation was quick. Uh, save file was quick. It was all really good. Um, there's... I like the suspended animation you can put the game into, where mm -hmm. you can just come right back. You know, you can leave, go to the PS menu, come back in before you had to quit the game. And uh, mm -hmm. it's, uh, but you know, it was pretty cool. And it, it, it went from what I can tell, because we only got a chance to play two games before we were getting ready to pass out and die. Um, you play the game, take the game out, play another game, but it looks like it's got a little save because mm -hmm. we we went from Injustice to Lego Marvel, but Injustice was still kind of there. Like we can yeah. put the disc back in and just hop it looks right like back in. yeah like like um what is it um, Blu-ray player yeah. where you take the disc out you play a whole another movie and you stick it in and then you're right back at exactly where you took that disc right. out if you want to watch it from there right so that gives you the ability to have friends come over and go hey can we play NBA 2K15 and go sure. okay sure I, and was, then, I was playing Creed but whatever <laughs> but uh I mean uh, now there's an app for the phones. Um, which is supposed, if I remember correctly, to be used as a Blu-ray controller since there are no Blu-ray controllers that will work with PS4. Um, and also keep track of your friends and all that stuff. That does not work right now. It's a glorified trophy app. Um, but I'm sure they're going to get that up with day one stuff. Um, we, have, we have a Vita, so we will be trying the second screen stuff eventually um, once we have slept. <laughs> Sleeping is important. And yeah, I mean, so... Um, all next week, uh, hopefully some this this weekend, you know, but mostly all next week is when we're going to be posting gaming footage. And I know you'll be thinking about Xbox One, but really don't. Just don't. Just think about PS4. Yeah, because Xbox One, they tell you they're not going to. They are, people. They're going to stab you in the back. They're going to try to take over the world. I'm telling you it's going to happen. Just think about this. When you receive your console, if you get an Xbox One, all the spying and hate DRM crap that you did not like is currently in that system. You have to patch it to make it not that. So you are currently buying the thing you hated. Just remember that. And that patch is a quick off switch. <laughs> Pretty much. So, um, but we like the game. The, it, both Lego Marvel, um, I'm not sure if it was 1080, but it looked 1080. And then, uh, uh, what do you call it? Um, Injustice looked really good it looked amazing it looked it looked super good i mean like i'm playing a lego game and i'm sitting there going ah it's iron man yes marvel <laughs> uh they're really good um one Speaking quick thing of that. yeah well, oh see look at that just great mind thing of life yeah get up my head charles so one thing that we really focused on was after the marvel logo came up this other logo came up um warner brothers okay what have we learned from this game that it is possible for Warner Brothers and Marvel to work together to put out a product which means which means there is very good possibility and it's probably not a possibility but there's a chance for Marvel versus DC hell just give us Avengers versus Justice League they made they may touch the wires and do a Lego Marvel versus DC because that's harmless and no one takes that seriously and we're okay with that. We're okay. I and mean, when you, yeah. once you see that people are buying it like hotcakes, because maybe they want to take parts of Superman and Batman, and put it on the Hulk, then maybe they're like, "Hey, I have an idea. Let's make a Marvel versus DC game." No one's thought of that. <laughs> Let's make a everyone's, fighter. Everyone's thought. Every, actually, everyone's literally thought everyone on this planet that's <laughs> ever played a fighting game has thought of this at one point. But hopefully, that that means you know some good th stuff coming up. Uh, we have a, a bunch of games to get to. We're going to be playing them like crazy over the next few days. Um, but one thing that it's going to take a back seat to is next uh, Saturday and Sunday is Long Beach Comic Con. Long Beach Comic Con! We have a table. And if you have children's, um, we'll be doing a kids event uh, Saturday from 3 to 4 and Sunday from 1 to 2. Um, in the kids area at Long Beach Comic Con where we're going to be drawing kids into our comic book series Heroes Are Us uh, free candy, t-shirts, all that good stuff um, so come out and see us uh, mm -hmm. also come by our table we'll be handing out um, coloring pages with some of our not yet released characters um, and it's all for the kids it's all yeah. for the kids great stuff for kids to take a look at our take a look at our stuff and remember, 
is harmless. Right. These are for the children. Yeah. So this is for your kids to come by, have some fun, meet some people. Right. And come by our booth. Um, our, our, our new t-shirts are $25. Everything else is $5. So... Cheap table, what? <laughs> and then we got a hot cosplayer chick. So yeah, you know what we up. got something for everybody. Yeah, they, I mean everyone's gonna be happy with this. So just stop on by, and support us. Um, another thing, if you are sending us messages on here on YouTube or are leaving us comments, if you've noticed we have not responded, it is because there is a new policy where you have to have a Google Plus account. And we're not doing that because it makes you display a real name. And if you notice, there are currently two of us. So we can't be Offshoot Comics. We can't be Walter Bryant. We can't be David Clark. So we're going to stay on this old format until we figure out a way around it. Um, but just so you know, we are not ignoring you. We just literally have no ability to respond. We click in the box and nothing happens. Yeah, now... The only good thing that we can do is if you have a Google Plus account and you write us, you can leave us messages. You can leave us messages yeah. and we'll answer you here if it's a message Remember, that uh, you can leave us comments. Yeah. If you send us a message to our inbox, we cannot get it. So it has to be on the video. Um, but if it's something really important, we prefer that you send us an email to offshootcomics at gmail.com. That we will get guaranteed. Yeah, and we can answer that. Or if it's something that you would like to see on the video, we can make a video. Yeah. Also, we have an app on iOS called All Street Comics. Deload it. Buy it. Love it. Or if you don't have an Apple, um, go on to our store, offshootcomicsstore.com, or just go to offshootcomics.com, hit store. And uh, you can buy our comics there digitally. It's only a dollar for issue. So, And some of those issues are pretty big. <laughs> so, but yeah, that's what's, uh, what's going on with us. We're going to try and get all that together. Um, but... Until the next time, we bring your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. See you later, guys. Hey, guys, don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe, and share our videos like crazy. That's right, because we love you, we want you to love us, and we want to keep making videos for you. And keep leaving us comments. We love comments. Yes, and we answer comments. Unlike some of the other guys, we'll get out there, we'll answer And if you uh, have a great comment, we'll make a video about it. And if you have a not-so-great comment, we will try to address that issue. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, thanks. Till next time, we've been your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. See you later, guys.